So hello everyone, so welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to do SSH on Windows. So basically I'm going to use party and um, allowing SSH client on Windows. So basically Windows 10 has inbuilt SSH client. So what you need to do is to go to your settings, wait for it to open and then come to apps. So when you come to apps, you just click on optional features. Alright, so you come down, so you can say have open SSH client and open SSH server. You should have both of them here. So if you don't have it, if you think you've not um, installed it, so you can see I've already installed them here. So if you think you don't have them or you don't have them, so basically just click on add new and then come to open SSH. So you will find them here if you've not installed them. And if you want to install, you just click on it and then hit install. All right, so I've already done them. Good. So the next thing is to open up your fire firewall um, rules. So you can just type, you can hit the Windows key on the keyboard and type firewall. All right. So that's you can click on this one. So after click on it, just come to advanced settings. Allow. I always have password for this thing, so just allow. And then come to inbound rules, and let's set a new rule. So it's a port number. So SSH client come with a default SSH um, default port number, which is 22. So basically, if you want to do it, you have to allow the port on your firewall before you can access your Windows remotely. So hit port, and then come to, it's a TCP, um, and then specify local port. So 22, and then allow connection, and domain private and public. Okay. So name name should be like just define any name for it so for 22 allow that's all so hit finish so you find the rule here which says for 22 allow if you want to delete you can just click on delete but basically i'm done with this part so the next thing is to actually find my user so what do you do to just go to settings and click on account all right so your info so basically this is my user name if i use a local um a, um a local user so you can use that name with the ip address so let me just close it and the next thing is to open up party so let me just close this part let's open up party i'll leave the description below to install party all right and the next thing is let's find the ip address of our pc you can just type cmd um that's like open the command prompt and type ip config so let me see. So this is my IP address. This one. I'm using a wireless. So this is my IP address. So I can just come to party and type the IP address. 172.20.33.167. And SSH default port 22. And then let's hit open. So it's going to pop up. If it comes with a, a, um, an information at the beginning, you just hit yes and continue. So I'm logging as my user, which I saw. Um, I use my Gmail to log into my PC and hit enter. And then I'm going to enter the password. So, so the password I use for my PC, that's what I'm going to use. So basically you can see I've opened it up. You can type directory and you can see everything here that I've done. So CD to documents. And if I type directory, you can see all the files here that I have. So basically that's how to um, access your window remotely. All right. And thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to my channel for more. All right. Bye.